teams ahead of us here have their eyes firmly fixed on the grand prize. They both believe it is within their compass. Having come this far, they're entitled to believe that. The competition has provided us with a lot of drama up to this point, and I'm sure there is plenty more to come before it reaches its ultimate climax. truly is quite a sight to behold here, the Minerao amongst the largest stadia in this part of the world. And we rise now for the Spanish national anthem. Quite some performance, and now here comes the response. So it's a straight shootout for the final, that's what we're going to see. There's nowhere, Jim, you would rather be. Well, one of the occasions of the calendar and in an atmosphere to match, we may well see a high-octane contest where both really look to test respective defences. I sincerely hope we avoid the alternative, which is a potential game of, of chess. Nobody wants that. It deserves much more. There's the whistle, and here we go. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Thiago Alcantara. He's someone who can really control the game from midfield. He's got a... That's a hit! And he's done it! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Spain are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, registering that crucial first goal has now given them more incentive and, and motivate. Shapes to shoot! Back of the net! And with the match still in its infancy, they are easing away. His position was perfect, the invitation was there for him, and his response absolutely clinical. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Spain grab a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. No doubt. Ferran Torres! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. That's just front foot enforcement. Pressure leads to mistake, leads to chance. OK, goes looking, Ferran Torres, and Pablo Sarabia, Pablo Sarabia! Oh, that was no routine save. Sarabia is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save, a lovely little footballing moment. Lorenzo Insigne, good challenge, he just stood firm. Italy can't seem to retain possession, and it's Ferrati. Italy have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but 
what's their thinking? Um, I, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. And out to safety. What a throw in. Thiago. Speculative strike. Referee's given a throw. Thiago coming up to half time, leading, and things are looking pretty good. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. Cheers up. Insigne, Italy have a free kick. Great leap! It's anyone's ball. Semi-final reaches halfway. We'll back on the first 45 minutes. Spain are two up and everything is shaping nicely. The only criticism, it could have been three. Spain sitting pretty here at half-time. 2-0 up. That gets things going for the second half. A reported change to either side during the break. And here's Pablo Sarabia. Pablo Sarabia. A great ball. Goes to finish. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? And it's Koke. He's tried one. Oh, fine stop from the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Pablo Sarabia. And now the breakaway. It's got through to him. And Pablo Sarabia! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Another example of how comfortable this team is on the break. Florenti goes upfield. El Sharawi crosses. Forward it goes. Lorenzo Insigne. Okay. Looking to break out here. And that is as far as they're going to go. Tries to get it forward quickly. Ferran Torres. Thiago. Quick has a goal! I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Keeper's got good distance on that. The uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Chiellini positions himself well and cuts it out. Hoists it forward. That's the throw. So here comes the substitution. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real on a shift. And he's cut it out. Thiago. What a tries a shot! Look the likely outcome. Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box.
Italy making another change here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Italy give themselves a chance of a fairy tale finish. Sports official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. Spain need to hold on for a few more moments. Has a pop! And that is it. The equaliser just wouldn't come. It is over. So the final now awaits.